chair here. Throw it in. It's got aluminum base here if I can smack it off, but sometimes it'd be hard to get off. Yeah. Scrap metal. But yeah, I got uh, a weed whacker and a uh, hedge trimmer yesterday. Electric. Was it on camera? It's on the way home. I'm locking the door. That's this guy about it. It's actually plastic, but it's got aluminum size, aluminum wire, so I'll take it. Okay, just stand by. Hold on. Okay, it's mine. I'm just gonna cut it in half. It's aluminum wire, it's the money. Not too big for my car, but. Let me grab this just that Okay. Okay, we're done on there. I haven't done the street for a while here, so kind of a, just never know what pops up. It's kind of like a hidden area here, it's just kind of like a few streets that are kind of like dead ends, but I always find the odd things, sometimes appliances, you just never know. Being Sunday, right, you know, maybe there's some last chance things thrown out, right? Okay. Seen a couple bicycles up the road, so I'll probably go, go back and grab them. It's cast aluminum right here, see that? Be worthy of taking off. You just go like this, unscrew this. Yeah. Hey, you got you got more metal. Huh? You have more scrap metal, no? Uh, no. no, okay. Recycle. See these ones here now. You just pull the screw out here. Just screw it here. And I'm stripping in the field. See that? Can't get any easier than this. Cast aluminum. You have to pay attention to the metals that you get, right? See, I'll probably get a couple pounds when I strip all this. A little bit rustier, but cut of the grinder. So, you just never know what's out there. I'm gonna go back into Sally here. Probably got about three pounds of aluminum there, cast aluminum. Got about what, 60 cents? Almost 70 cents a pound. And the other stuff is pretty heavy. I can get it, probably throw it in the HMS. It's heavy steel, possibly. So some of these alleys, like I say, they produce. There's not a lot of alleys in Syria, but there is some. And then you find the odds and ends. Just 
just never know what's there. Okay, all this alley's pretty dry. Yeah. I was worried about there's some kids here in the bushes here with their bikes. Nope, they're all all junkers, flat tires. There's a bunch of houses in here. This one's full. This one's flat. So got aluminum wheels. So I'll take it. Say I'll cruise because people throw stuff out Sunday. It's probably been out since Saturday. That's a Norco. That's actually a nice bike here. Hmm. Shame, but we'll see. Let's see what I'll do. I don't know. It's a big size frame. This one. A bit rusty. Can't okay, in. Oh yeah, why did you need a bike? Yeah. I started to grab smoke, so I was going to grab two of them on the way back. You need a bike? Oh, I just like fixing them up and giving them to people. Oh, oh yeah, you want the Norco? Yeah, sure, why not? To me, it's just, you know, scrap metal, but this yeah. one looks like it's got a life. Yeah, I like working on bikes and fixing them. Put them at the end of the driver for... This one, there's a little bit, little bit of hope for you. You can probably drive yourself even, it's a big, big one, right? Yeah, we're good. tires. Yeah, the other ones are flat tires. Cool, give, give a second home, right? Yeah, no doubt. Okay, take care, buddy. Yeah, you too. See ya. It's not all about money. It's about... It's about the next thing. Okay. Okay, hopefully I can put it in here. Steel. It's been here for a while. It's been, uh, it's all wet. So you had some bikes in here, that's why it's just... Oh uh, yeah, I could take it. Yeah, I know. I had some bikes in here, that's why it's a little bit difficult, right? But yeah. You're making a couple bucks getting staff, I got one right there. I'll take it, I'll come back and take it. What else you got? Some other stuff there? No, that's about it, just that. Okay, I'll come back in about 10 minutes. Oh yeah, no worries. Thank, thank you very much. Okay, perfect, thank you. Hundred percent. We'll come back. Perfect. Thank you. Yeah, it looked like I was fumbling, like I couldn't handle it, but pedals are in a way. So like I said, you get one, you get another one. Okay, so dump this and come back. It's actually a fridge up there, O2, also. to get the shaft out but is this all dirty baby It's the uh, curve here is the problem. Okay, we got some aluminum. I don't know how we can get the next one out, but curve creates a problem. Might be able to get it. sleeve right here so I might just cut it 
maybe next time just cut it with a little look over here it's bulges and it goes narrow cut the narrow part with this away from the sleeve must be a sleeve let's go further in or something it's our shaft okay there it is so this one is just maybe just dirty i'm not saying it's a big win but a little more for scrap pile They can fill this in the uh, dirty mortars. Scrap that later. So here's my wire, it's aluminum, still good, still worthy of a payday. Once I get the bin out of there, I can throw everything around the corner. But I'm gonna have one more bin here anyway, so I can get out of the power lines. So it's all aluminum, see? Either strip or salt the way it is. This one I can cut it down. Okay, so I have to go back and grab that stove. Almost similar grabbing that fridge also. The advantage is uh, got a big yard. Oh, here's that spring that came out of it. Weed whacker spring. aluminum plate here too she might be able to get out too yep there it is huh. rest of steel one aluminum weird must have been changed one's rusted
Weird, huh? Tight. Add value. Yep. More. Yep. Aluminum here. Cast. I might have lost one magnet already. A brass antenna, it's not it's a radio antenna, but it's not. Let's get that, come on, get that fridge now, I mean the stove, and get the fridge after I think. Okay, okay back where the stove is. Thank you. Hundreds of these. Got it once or twice. Oh yeah. Rubber. Yeah. I appreciate it. Thank you very much. No worries, man. Keeps the place clean. The area nice. Too bad I didn't have more to give it. Yeah, it makes a little extra money, right? Hey, wait, so it's up now, anyways. So right? nine, nine cents a pound right now. Yeah, I took a trailer full of four hundred kilos, and I got like uh, three hundred and twenty bucks. It must have been heavy steel. Yeah, when it's heavy steel, it's worth a lot more. Yeah. This is just 10, it's too late. Yeah, it's, just too it's worth probably about 12, 12 bucks, I would think. Yeah, that's all right. I appreciate it. Thank you very much. Have a good day, bro. Take care, buddy. Yep. Okay, well, that's done. I was going to look for that. I came to the street here to look for that uh, piano shell. We'll see unless the cars are covering it. Well, I got a ceiling for our hood fan, too. A little bonus, maybe a couple of carpal motors, maybe. Who knows? I have to go back there. I gotta meet someone at the yard, so it was over here. That thing was against a tree before. Somewhere around here. Not so much this tree, maybe. I think it was against this tree here. Yeah, it was here. Someone grabbed it. I was gonna come back here, but it's just so so darn heavy. Every time I come here, it's a full of my van. Oh well. It's probably about 300 pounds. But it was a good chunk of wood against it also. Anyways, okay. Hot one today, it's like point twenty eight right now. Okay. 
Okay. I don't know how I ended up with three stoves. It's weird. I had no appliances yesterday, except the one washing machine. The two stoves today, I'm not sure where the other one came from. As soon as I move the bin, um, or dump this garbage, I can put the bin right against here, and I'm gonna work way over there, out of not a, not there, like further there. Whew. Okay, now. I have to rearrange his mats, they suck. They just jam up and then everything goes, takes everything forward and they're fighting to get it in. Once it's repaired, I'm gonna put carpets in here and organize this better. I'll take it in the end of the week. I need about a week, a week to prepare it to prepare. I'm gonna save these here. People always asking for elements. Worth a couple bucks each. Okay. See what I'm gonna get now. Stuff like this like a strip. Any of these um, weird devices here? Like, I don't know what's in it, but modem switches, shard. This one I could probably strip and see what's in it. Things like a better enhanced value. This radio here. Instead of uh, probably a F 150. See, that's a heat sink right here. So you can probably get a couple boards out of there in a heat sink. This like about stuff here. DVD drives. Just gonna randomly start processing and but I want to set my table up after. So much electronic pieces here. No one here. Some kind of Dell thing. if there's anything in there here but never know I throw my adapters in here there's a lot of adapters I cut off anything that's heavy it's got weight it doesn't weigh nothing it's gonna go in the garbage can and go and shred directly. The garbage can over here. There's a lot of walking back and forth here. Uh, the kidney stones bugging me. I actually had kidney stones up in here. I, I coughed up probably six kidney stones already. And now there's one that's scratching my insides here and fighting that one off right now so see what happens on that one we sore a little bit here and there but when you move around and up and down bending that's when these kidney stones you start moving around I only had two real bad kidney stones that were that really painful but the most of them just give you a bit of a sore back a little bit in the back and it goes to your groin area and then next thing boom early morning falls out okay 
without giving you too many details, but so this is a pod. Like all these remote controls, they're useless. I look in, looked inside them, nothing. Some don't even have an IC chip. I, I don't know how they even work. It must must work off the TV set or something. Some shred. All this stuff is shred. It's wire here. There shouldn't be that much wire here. I got most of it, but you never know you find the other one. Some kind of e waste here. So we need one for garbage. So that will be we call this paper and plastic. All kinds of cameras and stuff here still. I don't know if they're any good. The resolution might be too old. Don't know. It's a little bit of cardboard I can recycle. Get the get the bin for the cardboard. Whatever that is. E disc is going. Power supply only. There's a wire there. Right now it's kind of hot, so maybe we can work in the shade a bit. Recycle what I can, cardboard that's clean. They're so picky now, these. Well, that is here. Lynx Plus Series Security System, probably outdated. It's a problem. It's a whole system here. Stop burglar. We should have a board in there, a little circuit board, but it won't be too bad. Drop the Nike body pack. Let's wet this container. Play the sensor switch. Batteries are gonna separate. You can't throw styrofoam recycling. So many stipulations now for recycling. Clear bottles, glass. I think this one is cardboard.
Recycle Center. Recycle Center. Recycle Center. Let's get rid of these bulbs. They need to be new. Ah, I bet you they're brand new. So it's probably good. The little control Samsung. I can throw the batteries at the uh, recycle place. Another one. Another container for these batteries. Circuit board. All these magazines. BMW manual, Chilton's, maybe wear something. Okay, so you can see it's a long, long process. Let's keep these for now. Okay, I'm gonna keep continuing. Okay, progress is slow, but I've uh, taken that shred. Let's recycle here. I'll fill up another recycle, I think, out of here. Uh, this clock has no nothing inside it. I thought it was had the guts. It doesn't have nothing. Steel. So, I thought, you know, I'm going to score some brass or something, but nope. Okay, over here, I'm gonna knock off this chain. I think it could be gold plated the chain. I'm thinking. Looks like it's gold color. Maybe gold plated. That's what I'm thinking. Gold plated so it doesn't tarnish. So, too bad it's a cheap, made in Korea, couldn't sell it, tried four times. So good progress, getting things done. Even these are aluminum. I think aluminum.
This is a shame, but this might be brass even. These pull your brass here, brass tips. So chain, I'm gonna do gold recovery on a chain at a later date. Once I clean this this bay out, which is gonna keep pushing that way, I'm gonna try to get that table there. Bring that table over. Okay, that's progress so far. Okay. She broke the window up. Really hard. I get some, get some water. This window here, I um, got it from a pickup. Some guy uh, brought it for twenty, or no, he brought it for twenty, but didn't want it, so he gave us still twenty dollars for uh, disposal. He wanted to, you know how windows have that steam inside, like uh, water damage? He wanted to kind of make some sort of uh, experiment where he could try to get rid of that, but it didn't work. So he said, okay, here, keep the 20 bucks, but he dumped the glass. Not working too good. So, so we did. Now we're dumping the glass. One got a couple of screws. So we'll clear this table off after. Okay, that's easy. I can use a dolly because it's pretty heavy. It's a drafting table. And all these computer things I can send over there against the wall, and that'd be my stripping of small stuff, and the bigger stuff will be on that side. Okay. So I think I'm going to call the video here just because uh, it's going to run too long. Oh, it's the shadow. I heard the case is kind of shot, but that's the problem when the cases are shot, hard to sell. Don't know. I heard. Hmm. I don't know, I'm going to check them later. I have to check them later. Um, the sink here, that's going to go into the HMS pile. So. It's not really much here, it's just mostly just little trinkets and stuff. Looks like I can move some of this stuff over here. I'm already starting right here. Things that have to be stripped down, some electronics. A little safety stuff is garbage. Too far gone. Tweezers. 
I keep the cabinet. I can put safety stuff in there myself, screw it to the wall here somewhere. Just put some odds and ends in there, band-aids or something. Okay guys, I think that's it for the video. I uh, hope you enjoyed it. I'm still continuing here, so you have to watch, watch the next phase, I guess. Okay guys, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, share, like. As always, have a great day. Okay, so I think uh, that's it for now. Kind of got the one bay cleaned. This is heavy metal here. I'm going to take the tap off. A couple taps of brass. That's going to be all shred. And then, um... Here's the gold plated pins. RCA's took off. Separate them for now. This is all going to be strippable here. A little bit of wire here, some tools, to strip all this. Here's worthy of maybe selling again. These are actually um, golf headlights. Looks like they're brand new. So maybe they're sellable. And then uh, those will be strippable, those lights are strippable. So you know what's even in this thing here. There's so much cardboard, I'll tell you. What's this for? Oh, it's for a mortar home. Wow. That's where the uh, fr stove goes, or the fridge. This is worth money here, framed for a bit of you. See? Something like that. It's almost like an AC unit. Oh, it's a microwave. It's a frame for a microwave. The motorhomes have something similar, but it's... it's like framing a microwave into a cabinet or something. So, it could be stainless steel. Shiny enough. Heavy. Okay, that's it here. I'm gonna see if that fridge is there, and I'll put the fridge in for now. On my way home. And then the next time I'm going to work here, get all this done. It's not really much here, it's just a few things. And then around the side, do some garbage. And then most of this lighting here I'm going to put over here. Some I'll just strip. So we're, we're getting progress. Just keep going this way. And then once the, um, there's only, it's just bare bones type of stuff. Just like this tarp here and a few things. Mostly shred material. Okay, let's see if the fridge is there, stand by. I'll just show you the bin. There's lots of room in the bin. What'll happen is it will start crunching down. Once I put more stuff on top, I'll get all this, whatever's here, that's garbage, and then over there. And then I'll put my bin somewhere here, and then I want to get rid of this fencing and whatever else, take one more load, okay. Let's see if it's still there. Stand by. The fridge here doesn't look too bad inside. I'm not sure if it looks like it's almost cut in the back. It looked. I think they, did, they were doing something with it. It's all pulled out. It's actually pretty heavy.
actually pretty heavy. Surprisingly. It could be so heavy. be about two, 250 pounds just to move it around it was so heavy, heavy. stuck in that kind of lip there okay okay guys thanks for watching I think that's it for the video make sure to subscribe share like as always have a great day thanks for watching